Hi everyone, Matt Stewart here with Cole Banker Ronin Realty, here to do the market stats for you for March of 2023. Again, I do educational videos for consumers across Simcoe County area. If you like what the information you're getting and find value in what we're talking about, please feel free to like and subscribe. We're going to jump into the market stats for Simcoe County now. As we look over to the Springwater area, the average sale price in February was sitting around 1.183. We saw a 3.6% jump up, now sitting around 1.225. We saw 35 new listings in February. We saw 63 in March. And then we saw 16 sales in February and 26 in March. Again, the numbers, it's good to see some balancing out. 3% that's a good increase on a month-over-month -month basis. As we move into spring, we're starting to see that inventory of 63 over 35 and as well as 26 new sales over 16 in February. Good sign in the spring water market. All right, everyone, thank you for tuning in, listening to our market stats for March of 2023. Again, if you ever have any questions or if you like the information I'm providing, please feel free to reach out or like and subscribe to our channel. Again, my takeaway for the market stats in March is what we're seeing here across the board is more inventory, more sales. The prices are staying relatively balanced, which is good. We saw Bank of Canada go two, two in a row now with rate holds as opposed to eight increases we saw last year. So that's a good sign for buyers and sellers out there. It's really showing us that the bottom of the market that everybody's waiting for is basically now. So if you're looking at buying, jumping in the market, talk to your mortgage broker, get into the market right now, start looking because you're gonna buy now, rates will eventually go down and then you'll be set up in a really good position for when prices do eventually increase again. And then for the sellers out there, if you're looking at making that upgrade, your upgrade is never gonna be cheaper than it is right now. So get out there, start looking, talk to your realtor, talk to your mortgage broker obviously first, but talk to your realtor, see what your home is even worth. Just get that evaluation to give you a baseline to see, okay, what's my home worth? Okay, what's that dream home worth now? And see if that's plausible, right? Um, what we're gonna see probably going through the spring is very consistent to this. You're seeing multiple offers start to come back. We're starting to see offer dates, but keep in mind, I said this on my last video, it doesn't necessarily mean 100K over asking or the craziness that we saw. It just means that there's gonna be good traffic on the home, they wanna hold offers, and we're seeing homes with multiple offers still sell at asking or under. Some are selling slightly over, but majority of them are at that asking or under price. So don't be scared of those situations. So again, if you ever have any information, always feel free to reach out to us or contact details are below. Again, if you like the information, please like and subscribe. Thanks.